Hey, man. Fuck. What do you want? I'm your friend. I don't want anything, man. Come on, your company's good enough, huh? Same as always. Yeah, thanks. I really appreciate that. So, family ain't back yet, huh? <laughs> nope. Oh, she's a goddamn fool, man. Despite all the chaos of these last few weeks, I think I finally figured it out. I know, no. sounds ridiculous. No, actually, it does not sound ridiculous, you know? Because you, you're a killer. You know, you are a man of action. You do not sit on couches, you take scores. You're back, man. We are back, all right? All we gotta go do is bust out Brad and then we're golden, man. Franklin, he makes us multicultural. Lester makes it cyber. We're like modern America. We just get ourselves a gay friend. Bam! No, it's not it. I got money. It just makes you miserable. I want to make movies. Great. It's great. And uh, so where exactly does this leave me in the second act of your life? We're going to do this last big job, and then we're going to dissolve the partnership. This is not a game to me. All right, this is a fucking way of life. I got a fucking family. Yeah, well, I got nothing. No one gives a fuck about me. I do. Oh, fuck you. I saw your grave. I mourned you. And then it turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. Everything. You're not dead, and you're not a man. Well, what the fuck are you? I'm your fucking nightmare! Yeah, enough with your goddamn threats! I mean, let me just ask you something, all right? Something I've been, I've been thinking about. Up in North Yankton, exactly who was buried in your place? I never gave it any thought. You know what I'm thinking? I had no clue. You treacherous piece of shit! You're fucking dead. You're fucking dead! Oh, fuck. Trevor! Hey! T! Where are you going? You know where I'm going. Fuck you. You don't need to go all the way to North Yankton to find out what I can tell you over a couple beers back in my house. Come on. We'll order pizza. Fuck you. Fuck your pizza. Fuck everything it stands for. This is insanity. Oh, no. No, it's clear and reason thought. Finally. Come on. Come back. We'll talk. I'm not going to listen to another one of your lies. Hey, I'll lay it all out for you. Everything. Turn around. I'm going up there to see it for myself. You'll be disappointed. <laughs> oh, I'll be something. It'll be an anti-climax. The grave's empty. Just a bag of sand, something like that. Just smoke and mirrors. Ooh, the lies! How do you do it, man? The game is up! I'm trying to save you a trip. You've done me enough favors, buddy, right? Save your fucking breath! Trevor, come on! Fuck you, Michael! Soon enough, I will. Trevor? It's great to, uh... There a plane I can use? Get me across country? Sure. Sure. We got one fueled up for a trip south of the border. I'm taking it. Is everything okay, man? Everything is not okay. Nothing has ever been okay, but I gotta see it for myself. I'm gonna see an old friend, all right? You're where I think you are, buddy. I don't know why I didn't see it. I guess, I guess I didn't want to. Fuck! Maybe I knew all along. I'm gonna find out for sure, and I'm gonna do something about it. There's always something wrong with that job. What went down after, I guess. I guess I wanted to believe fucking, fucking play circus! Idiot, idiot! 
Idiot! I'm sorry, Trevor. Who you got in here, huh? As if I need to ask. Hey, you're wasting your time. Is that why you flew out here? Huh? Tell me I'm wasting my time? Go ahead, dig it up. I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's what you look like. The guy who doesn't give a shit. That's ridiculous. How long are you gonna keep lying for, Mikey, huh? When's it gonna stop? What happens in the dark comes out in the light. I'll give it a rest, Trevor. <laughs> There's nothing there. <sighs> this is it. Moment of truth. 
If I didn't know. Brad! Look, we do what we gotta do to survive. This thing, it didn't work out the way it was supposed to. Oh, and how was that, huh? With Brad in the can and me in the ground, or, 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 or both of us in the coffin? Brad got shot. You saw it. He didn't make it. I got shot, I did. That's, that's it. I think the only thing that didn't go as planned was me showing up on your doorstep ten years later. Mikey, I mourned you. And I missed you. But I got a fucking family, Trevor. We were all gonna die. He did die. You reptilian motherfucker! I didn't want it to come to this. Yes, you did! You just don't have the fucking balls to do it! But I do! I got more to lose than you. Never a truer word has been spoken, brother. Now pull the fucking trigger. You ain't got the guts. Take the fucking shot! Who is that? Fuck! Ah, fuck! Fuck! Joe Phillips! Mr. Cho has requested a word! Hey, ho, ho, I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how's this event? How's this event? Get the boyfriend! Boyfriend? Motherfucker. Who are your friends, T? Hey, you got the wrong guy! You are going nowhere, mister! Phillips went that away! You are screwed! Give it up! You're making a mistake! Hey, go fuck yourself! You idiot! We could have teamed up! 
，你们一起去死吧！救命啊！把那男朋友抓起来！他妈的！ Hey, can we do this where the weather's better? This is how many guys you send to kill Trevor Phillips? This is the guy. You don't want to die. Fuck off, you confused pieces of shit. Trevor, you dick. What the hell? Oh yeah, what? Philip, not dead. Now we have to kill his wife. The guy. The guy. You're out of your element. This is it for you. 枪了！他妈的！我他妈的一定要杀你 ！You are going nowhere, Mister. He's getting away. You're on ice, prick. You are screwed. Give it up. We're gonna go down. I ain't got anything against you people. Hey, you got the wrong guy. You are a man. You're way off, assholes. You shot the whole people. This dog is yelling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, go fuck yourself. Phillips went that away. We got you, you idiot. Hold way. Any minute now. You're making a mistake. <sighs> Trevor. Fuck! What the hell? He's here. 让我看你手。You got nowhere to go, boyfriend. All right, all right. Get out the fucking car. Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao? Yeah, the ex-nut. Backed out of a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. <laughs> was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. Sorry I had to cut out. Your operation causes problem for me. I want to expand into Blaine County. But your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Oh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? My Cody Santa. You live in your trailer together with the maid. And then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up for his safety. <laughs> My lover! Yeah, right! It's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't going anywhere. I'm serious about this. He will die. Tell him I love him dearly.
win-win for both of us. Hey, 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 hey! What do you think? Nice house, isn't it? You like it? I'm selling it. You want to buy it? I'm downsizing. No, no, I'm good. I used to sell houses like this all the time, okay? I sold dreams. I made lives meaningful. I'm not sure about that. Oh, but you like, you like beautiful things, though, don't you? Sure. Well, I just happen to know the most beautiful woman. You want a bouncy bouncy. Josh. Josh Bernstein. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the Josh Bernstein. Yeah, I never heard of you. Oh, well, I used to be a big deal once in real estate, and so I had my license taken away. <laughs> my meal ticket. Where's the chick? I'll get to that, I'll get to that. See, it's not really, it's not really money that I'm after here. It's just, it's a little something more awkward than that. Now, Lenny Avery. <laughs> He, he was my best friend. And now, he has taken all of my clients. All of them. Do you think that you could take out all of his for sale signs? That was easy. She's worth it, man. I love you. I love you. I love you. Lenny. Avery. Lamar Davis, what's up? I'm part of the team. That's what's up. Team? I don't do teams. Uh, Devin Weston's car still a team? The one Frank's running. Oh, oh yeah, that one. Hey, look, I boosted the ride. I'm about to meet your boy Franklin, and I need your ass to pick up the Packer, meet us outside the garage, and we taking these motherfuckers up to Polito Bay. All right, buddy. Fine. That's a long trip. He over at the usual place. The boost, homie. How'd it go? Any problems? You know me, fool. Yeah, I do know you, fool. So what you think? Smooth as silk. I'm thinking where the blood stains and the bullet holes and shit. Man, fuck. That amateur shit behind me, I'm a professional now. Like you and them old dudes. So tell me what happened. I saw the ride. I took the ride. No drama. No security. No one said, who the fuck is this gangly motherfucker doing in my car? Nothing. That's worrying, man. That's some shady ass shit. Man, chill. Be careful. Line it up on the truck. My favorite gangbang. That's teamwork, motherfuckers. Boss man's happy. Then we'll get moving. And this old bust ass nigga ain't no ball. Enough, nigga. Get your ass in the truck. Let's go. Let's get the truck. We'll let obey. Sonora Freeway. Hey, it's uh cozy in here. Scooch up, homie. Yeah. Scooch over here. Scooching in that crazy dude? Oh hell no, that nigga stank. Get over here. I don't bite. Dang what I heard. 
all cannibalistic and shit. Frank, what you been telling him? I say what I see, homie. You dig on man meat. Ah, uh, rumor and hearsay. We got a long way to go. I'd get comfortable. All right, nigga, but don't try nothing. How far is it? In this thing? Yeah, about four hours. Shit. It's your operation, Slick. Shit, if you all right driving, I'm gonna catch up on some sleep. Go for it. It's all right being the boss. Meant to be running things, but this fool's sleep. Yeah, I'll be asleep when your ass stop talking, nigga. Some boss. Hey man, where that other dude? The dude that creeped on that dude. Michael, his creeping days are done. Well, what you mean? He stopped creeping? No more creeping for him. He like retired from from creeping. From everything. That's funny, cause like the boy Frank didn't mention shit about that. And as a matter of fact, I don't even know the dude. But considering the mutual acquaintances we got, I would have liked an invite to the retirement party. There weren't no party. No party? I used the term retirement. Euphemistically. Homie, for a dude that kills dudes and eats dudes and fuck dudes, you talk fruit. It's unconfirmed. What's unconfirmed? The fact that you talk stupid or the fact that you do some messed up shit? Or where the other dude's at? Like, maybe he's dead. The last one. Oh shit, man. Fuck. Do Frank know about this? I don't know if Franklin knows, but let's just let him sleep. Shit. Yeah, it's a bummer. But you know. He wasn't the good guy he made out. Man, dude was a killer, a thief, a liar, and irritable as shit. Yeah, a liar. Above all else, a fucking liar. Homie, you sound like some bitch he ain't called. Like, oh, he lied to me. I am some bitch he didn't call for ten years. Fuck, man, he fucked you. The fucker got fucked. Damn, he fucked the fucker himself. Shut up. Uh, man, the first time's always special. I hope he was gentle with you. Enough of that! And enough about me fucking. I don't do that. As a rule. Maybe when I got to LS, I was, I was a little overwhelmed by the place. I had a little out of control. But that ain't who I am, for the most part. But the Michael fucked you. Yeah. The Michael fucked me. And the Michael fucked Brad. And the Michael ran off with the FIB. Brad? Who? Who the fuck is Brad? Brad is our boy back from the dead. And Michael killed him? Michael got him killed. He died when Michael faked his death. I thought Michael died and Brad was in the pen, when actually Brad was in the ground and Michael was in hiding. And now Michael's dead and it's all okay? Michael's current condition is unconfirmed. I said that. But if he was dead, you'd be cool because of this Brad dude who died whenever. <sighs> yes. Man, I thought you and Michael were tight. So did I. Okay, that make a lot of fucking sense. It's a lonely old road, ain't it? Lonely? Hey, I couldn't say. I mean, not really. A road's a road. It ain't got abandonment issues. Truckers on the blacktop making do? I don't need to make do. I need to make snaps on these rides. Sure. Yeah, the time will come. It's what happens before we get paid is what? Franklin's asleep. Just me and you. What? What you trying to say? You want me to jack you off or something? Jesus, no. God, no. Of course not. Unless... Man, you's a sick fiend. Just fiending for some friendship. Friendship? Right, whatever, man. It's just... Truckers are a symbol of this country. No part of its mythology like cowboys, gangsters, hobos, gangbang. Truckers are about the unsexiest myth I ever heard. Apart from hobos. Uh, maybe tired with hobo. Freedom. Loners in the night. You know what truckers do? Cut up women and get other dudes to jack them off. Come to think about it, aside from not lugging freight around the country, you got about all the necessary prerequisites for a fine career in haulage. No shame in that. If you don't want to get paid or enjoy human contact. Money's bullshit. So is friendship. All right, all right, all right. I see you still touching. How's Franklin doing over there? Aw, uh, dude getting paid to sleep. Don't even worry about him. Ah, uh, sleep of innocence. So he, like, in charge on this one? You work for him? He's a kind of figurehead. A puppet, if you like. With Devin Weston's hand up his ass. Right up to the elbow. That dude, real shame. Ooh, he's repulsive. But, well, once he's paid us, he can be whatever we want him to be. What you want him to be? 
I want him to be someone who understands that all the money in the world can't save him from a nasty guy who thinks he's an asshole. Now that's something I want to see. So, uh, tell me, man, how y'all end up meet? Michael introduced us. Me and Frank didn't exactly travel in similar circles. Nah, I mean the creeper. Michael? Ha! <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you know. Sorry, I don't want to reminisce. The wounds ain't healed. You such a delicate little old bitch, ain't you? Where your pussy at? What you got in there? Screw you! That's good. Let it out, homie. Go on, let it out. Vent. The turd was probably playing me from the start. Right, yeah. Probably. How you do it? Where? When? All right. All right! Fuck! I was running this small air freight outfit in North Yankton. Tiny operation. There's one beagle I could borrow when I needed it. We were kids. Kids with planes. So, this guy I know says there's this other guy who needs some hot cargo moved across the border. Money's good, and I don't know enough to check references, so I'm in. A few days later, I'm waiting on the runway, and I see this dust coming up off the road. Only, it ain't one dust trail, it's two. I got told one guy in cargo. First car comes through the gate, stops, someone comes out. It's my age, just 20, kind of fat but strong under me. Love at first sight. Yeah, something like that. Other car comes through the gate. Old guy falls out, starts yelling, waving his arms and pointing at the kid. The dude that got Jack? Who fucking knows? Fat guy's running, old guy's shouting. I don't really care, I play peacemaker. Concerned citizen. I get close to the old guy and I pull out this flare gun I'm carrying around, squeeze the thing off in his eye. Shit. That was horrible. We had to pick up the body and dump it in a lake on the way. Thing was still burning in his head when we dropped him. Plane never smelt the same. Both of us threw up when we landed. It was quite a baptism. You ain't never clapped nobody before? Not really. Some deer, foxes, drifters, nothing serious. Ha! So that was like it? You and Michael rolling on through? Mas o menos. Michael didn't have the nerve back then. I didn't have the direction. Kind of worked. Until Michael got his nerve. Until he got it, and he lost it. But that's another story. So, tell me, man, what, what about you and Frank? Oh, hell no, nah, homie. It ain't like that. We ain't like y'all. You know, niggas don't get out like that. I mean, one time we was both fucking this bitch, and I was about to go in, and we kind of, like, touched dicks, but it wasn't even like a slap or nothing. I mean, man, it was like almost like a brush, you know? I mean, that shit, it, it, it wasn't nothing, homie. It, it, it wasn't even, like, awkward or nothing. But, boozy motherfucker, one time was on the ride. What you gonna do, oh fearless leader? Okay, shit, I got an idea. Keep driving. I'm gonna take the tricked out JB700 and get rid of the tail. Devin's lawyer said there'd be some new hardware on board. Hey, take this headset. They must have waited till we was out of town. Yeah, it looks like it, don't it? We have reason to believe you were transporting stolen vehicles. Pull over to the side of the road. Man, I should have known this would go wrong. Huh?
Mr. Clinton, where are you? We're coming up to GOA. Man, the cops was all over us. They slowed us down some. That's not surprising. The insurance companies have been pressurizing them to find you since the studio break-in. You knew there'd be heat? Man, you could have told us. Don't get emotional. We're waiting at Procopio Truck Stop. Be here soon. We're taking a ride to the truck stop at Procopio. Roger that. I'm gonna speak to the legal counsel one. Get us paid. Yeah, I heard about that CEO pay shit. Just make sure it's fair salary for the workforce, motherfucker. Yeah, what he said. You taking care of him. Head back to town. Hello, Franklin. Yeah, where Devin at? Somewhere meditating or ripping somebody off? In light of the drama your efforts caused, we felt it was not perhaps the best idea for you two to be seen together for a while. Where's the money? Mr. Weston is one of the most brilliant investors the world has ever known. He's... obviously a maverick, but he's also rigorous in his research. Yeah, he may be brilliant. Look, let me be the first to tell you. He ain't gonna fall in love with your ass. Now, where the fuck is my money? The best thing that could have happened to you in this situation has happened. He is going to hold your money, invest it in his Alpha Fund, and make the funds available to you at a time as the transfer will not induce any undue attention. Which is a polite way of saying I'm getting robbed? Are you fucking kidding me? That is a short-sighted and frankly immature way of seeing things, Mr. Clinton. Let's go. I boost cars and pop motherfuckers. Maturity is not really my fucking thing. Hello, boy. What's that? You said a man is stuck in a tree. And he needs my help? Part of you would rather leave him there because he's a bit of a dick. But you're doing your civic duty. Okay, shit, show me. I've officially lost my damn mind. What, boy? He just jumped out of a fucking helicopter. His parachute fell to open? And now you kind of wish he'd missed a tree. But morality is a human construct and you are not hardwired to think that way? I can't believe I'm getting smart talked by a fucking dog. Say what? Wait, you talking about my kind of bitches or yours? This shit is getting weird now, man. Wrong. Look at this fool. Hey, 
Hey, bro! <laughs> you mind giving me a hand here? Man, that's a cool-ass dog you got, homie. What dog? <laughs> that dog that saved your... saved your ass, man. Dude, I have no idea what you're talking about right now. What the fuck? Hello? <laughs> when you got a moment. Here My bad, dog. <sighs> oh. Oh. oh, man, that was wild. <sighs> Woo! See, I'm not an adrenaline junkie. I'm a control junkie. Yeah, that parachuting is intense, man. And hey, if along the way I figure out what it means to be alive, well then, let's just make this a little spiritual and say I'm on a thought journey. <laughs> shit, nothing helps me think clearly like shitting myself while I'm heading towards a certain death, man. Then you're up for it. Not really, dog. Shit, I respect gravity. Oh, I knew you were a pussy. Come on. It's safe, I promise you. Safer than driving a car. The only way it's safer is if you drive a car to a fucking airplane. Come on! Let's go! Here comes my pilot! Let's next level this shit! Yo, Jeff! You wanna take a bit longer next time, dude? Man, fuck, I gotta learn how to say no. You take the left side, man! Yeah, I said left side, man! You know the one that's not on the right? Here's a headset to keep in touch with the Dominator, and a parachute to stop you from dying. All aboard? Okay, Jeff, round two, set her up. Roger that, buddy. Uh, you sure you're okay? That last one was in fucking sight. Dude, how crazy was that? I was dropping like a dot-com stock in late 2000. Cat out of the window. Tell me you got it, please. Tell me you got it. We gotta upload that shit right now. I'm uh, sorry, man, it's all out of focus. I couldn't keep you in the shot. I, I thought you'd fret for show. Oh, man, I could hear myself screaming. But inside, I was ice cold. Totally present in the moment. Like, for a few seconds, I saw everything, and it all made sense. You know what I mean? Like, everything. Shit, man, until your crazy ass hit that tree. Dude, did I choose the tree, or did the tree choose me? You know what I'm saying? It's the journey that matters, not the destination. Am I right, Jeff? Dominator, buddy. You are the Dominator. Because in the case of skydiving, shit, the destination seems kind of important to me. So what syllabus did you rock? AFF? You all good with the PLF? Say like, what? What's your training background? Man, I found your crazy dumbass in the tree, and now I'm here. That's all the background your ass need to know. Virgin in the drop zone! Hymen in the hole! <laughs> no, but seriously, I got you. Don't sweat it. It's not rocket science, although... It is, in some ways. But I'm talking metaphorically. Like, like you with that dog. I didn't get that, by the way. Wait, wait, hold on, man. So you telling me you had no memory of a fucking dog? Dude, there you go again. It's off kilter, and I dig that about you. But we need to get on the same page, bud. Strategize and synergize. You feel me? Like the double helix. I'm so pumped! Okay! Let's shred this! You first, Wolfo! Go on now! Do it! This the sky, dude! Oh, shit! This 
shit is insane! Here we go! Might as well get on the bike! It's a long walk home! Okay, last one down the mountain buys the protein shakes! Oh, look who showed up! Pretend you're your dong and hang a left! Whoa, gnarly stretch here! Don't bonk it! myself and you wasn't even pushing me whatever bro i know this bike i know this body i was operating at the perimeter of my parameters and you were being reckless and now you're having a winch a what listen meet me by the airport when you're grown up here all right It's me, dog. Where we at? We're at Enzo Benelli. Mafia guy turned real estate developer. He's bullied his way onto half the building contracts in Los Santos. Extortion, murder, labor racketeering, you name it. There's not a construction worker in town earning a livable wage right now, and Gold Coast Development is about to go under. <laughs> and let me guess, you got a personal interest in Gold Coast, right? <laughs> Anyone think you'd done this before? According to Benelli's cell phone, he's at the construction site downtown. It's done. 
One small problem. My source squealed. Benelli's expecting a hit. Watch yourself and go equipped. You'll have a lot of muscle. And you're telling me to calm down? I'm going to stay near the chopper. You dumb fucks do your job. Yeah, sure, fine. Just wanna get in my way? Where's Enzo? Where the fuck is he? I'll blaze all you fools if I have to. I'm putting you out of business, motherfuckers.
Here we go! Taken care of, but man, that shit went south. I know. We better let this simmer now. Way too much heat. Very nice work, Franklin. Fucked up. We are women. We are free. We're bringing an end to the patriarchy. We are women. Hear our pain. We are women. Hear our shout. We are women. We have no doubt. We are women, we are free! We are Shut the here. fuck up! Thank you. Oh, my N-word, huh? What What's up, up homie, huh? Oh. <laughs> oh. What a, is that how you act, huh, when a, when a friend makes a mistake, huh? No. Really? Man. Oh, no. What, oh, so what, it's just me getting hurt, is that funny? No, huh? man. Well, fuck you! I'm gonna put you in the fucking ground, you laugh at me again! Man, calm down. I have met a lot of assholes in my life, but you? Oh, you're not long for this world if this is the way you fucking act, you little jumped up motherfucker! Look, how about this, man? Calm down. It was funny at first, man. I made a mistake. Unfortunately, man, you failed. It was funny, all right? I apologize. I accept your apology. Okay? All right, so let's hug it out. Mm -hmm. ah! Ah! <laughs> right? You're so fucking you're funny, gotcha. Huh? Oh, fuck, no, I'm not funny. I'm a fucking asshole. Oh. Fuck, I, I had a difficult childhood. Damn, man, you all right? Just, I'm just fucking on edge, you know? Look, I love you, right? But I would have... I would have just look, fucking... Look, 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 man, Lester said you had some information for us about Michael. Michael, fuck Michael, I hope he's dead. Man, I know y'all yeah. two, man. Come on, man. You two had beef before, but what the fuck happened in North Yankton? Somebody pinched him, man. Who? My friend Ron met these Chinese assholes. They're from Yangshan in China. We had some problems. They mistakenly thought Michael was a human being and kidnapped him. Yeah, and now it looks like they're holding him somewhere in the city. I guess. Come on, bro. Well, go fuck yourself. You want that piece of shit? That's your fucking business, all right? He's dead to me, all right? And chances are, if and when I see him, he's gonna be dead to everyone else as well. Hey, come on, bro, don't do that. You're pushing your luck, pal. What was that? What? What was that? Uh, nothing. Ah! Mm, asshole! Everybody! Assholes! <sighs> Hey, it's me. What did Trevor say? Man, Michael's being held by a Chinese crew. Because of Trevor. The irony isn't lost. I'm sending you an app for your phone. Michael's cell just came back online. This'll track its signal. It'll work better the closer you get. Be careful. Sure. I told you! He ain't my g -la. Don't try to persuade me, you're not lovers. He's laughing at you, you fucking idiot. You're making a mistake. It costs a lot of money to track you down. I had to call in every favor yeah. I could in the Midwest. And then you kill several good yeah. men. Good day, huh? Good day. Good fucking day to you! Kill him. Hey, Trevor hey. Phillips no. isn't coming. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, hey, hey, hey. Hey, this is a big fucking mistake. 